This week on the Dirt Head Shed, I get out of my garage and I go four wheeling with my buddies. Hey. Look, there's Fred. Tube socks looking sweet over here. I'm in Southern California. I got a rental truck and we're gonna go find Fred for his birthday. I love Nissans. Palm Springs is cool and all, but I wanna go to Johnson Valley. I haven't been in a year. Um, last time I was up there, I was up here for Fred's birthday party. Actually, last time I was here was for King of the Hammers, but two weeks before that was Fred's birthday party. So it's been a year and uh, that's too long. Johnson Valley is amazing. Yeah, I don't have a rock crawler. I'm in a two-wheel drive Nissan rental truck. But my buddy Mark is coming up, and I'm going to ride with him. And we're going to go out and do samurai things. I'm rolling through Yucca Valley. And it looks like I just found Brody and Mark at the gas station. Oh, wow. It looks like he brought out the really cool... Samurai. This is uh, Brody's rig. Mark is over there. These are some of the coolest spots for houses I have ever seen. Such a neat looking area. And there's like little houses and cottages and cabins like stuck all over in these rocky formations. It's awesome. These are all Joshua trees. This is like one of the only places in the world that these things will grow. Joshua Tree uh, National Park is right down the road, about 15 miles away. These things grow all over out here. Pretty wild looking. Feels like you're in like a Dr. Seuss movie. Sun's going down. Uh, hopefully we can get to camp before before it gets too dark out here. We got like 20 minutes to go. Woohoo, we made it. Awesome. That was my ride in Moab last year. All right, let's start unloading. Hi, Eric. Hey, right. We all partied a little too hard, except for Martin. Martin just showed up, day, yeah. day late and a dollar short, but looking smooth. Trying to. I think we're about to go hit the trail. Martin brought out the uh, the orange Jeep that oh. slayed Ultimate Adventure this year. So, right now, we play pretty much won. I don't know if it won, but it's a fun ride. It is. There's no winning. If you can make it to UA, you won. You won. <laughs> That's my, that was my thing. Did I show you that I got a set of these seats, but mine aren't quite as wild? No, you did? Yeah. Are you going to put them in the Mustang? I'm going to put them in Mom's Spaghetti. They're, they're the Serape and brown vinyl. Oh. They're pretty yeah. sick. That's OG. Yeah. Oh, I like how, how his look with like the tan or the brown Naga hide. In the houndstooth? In the houndstooth centers. Yeah. Things dope. All right, we're gonna go wheeling. <laughs> Our buddy Tony flew in from Canada and he was an engineer at Jeep. Now he uh, works for a company called Steer Smart and we're trying to get him hooked on Samurais. That's Jeep and Tony Carvalho driving an import. What? Ooh, I like it. It's so good. That's like a pretty stark difference, 392 Hemi AEV Jeep and a 1-3. Jeep and Joe's going to give motorcycle riding a shot today. Let's get rad. He is fully getting it. Try not to die. Job one. Myself. You have one job. Don't die. I'm cracking in. We're heading out for our morning ride. We're killing it today. Killing it. This should be pretty fun. Oh, it's gonna be awesome. Oh, my neck hurts. I don't think I crashed anything last night though. I'm going low. Are you? I'm good. You're going high? Mark Stock Samurai now has seat heaters. He says this thing never has anything. It doesn't it's the stock samurai, but it's yeah. not really that stock. Brap. Brap. <laughs> 
So we came out here to Johnson Valley again for Fred's birthday. Last year was 50. This is a big 5-1 for Fred. He's back there in tube sock. I'm sure he's getting rad. Um, but we're not actually going to Johnson Valley to go wheeling like Hammer's Trails. We're going to go run, I think, Rattlesnake Canyon or something that's going to run us from Johnson Valley back into Yucca Valley and go get lunch. It should be pretty fun. You did this trail last year? Yeah, it was awesome. It should be good. Everything out here in the desert's good. So much fun. I miss this stuff. Grizzin! Four pounds in the mile stars. Oh man, look at that thing. I missed it. Rad pre-runner truck going the other way. Katie's cruising to jail. What up? Ooh, that's a good truck. Tremor, six, seven. That's what I just lifted at work. That's a 350 though. That's a cool truck, dude. Brand new, paper plates on it. Booking it. Trying to find a clean spot to video through. Getting some rainwater coming in. Exceeding the 15 mile an hour speed limit. No. <laughs> this is rad. Nothing like cruising a desert wash in a rainstorm. That's smart. <laughs> and get some shots of the rear suspension doing all its work. This thing's on YJ Springs out back. Are they a lift? They're they're yeah, skyjackers, yeah. right? Two inch lift YJ springs, spring under. spring under. So it's like stock height, but it should have more travel. The front suspensions, homemade three link. Ford Aerostar coils and some Fox shocks, the Performance Series 2.0s. Tube sock, Brody sock, Brody your parking brake cable fell off. Frank sock. Sort of, sort of a roof. Whoa. I don't know if you can see, but Brody's Samurai, the rear end is like shifted all the way to the passenger side. We might have to stop and fix that thing before the rear end comes out from under it. He doesn't have a radio, right? He doesn't have a wheel. Pull up next to him. about to fall out. Is it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Brody. Yeah, the rear ends walked all the way over to the passenger side. Oh, red. It's probably an upper link bar that just loosened up and is extending out. Yeah. What's that? I think so. Dave? Yeah, I'm Dave. <laughs> I, I only said if I ever saw you on the trail, I wouldn't freak out, bro. Dude. <laughs> Good to see you, brother. You too. Damn, that's cool, Fred, man. Fred's right in no front of us. Shit. Yeah. I want, dude. Um, faster with Finnegan, dude. <laughs> Dave, dude. Oh my God, man. It's so cool, bro. Right to see on. you guys. Exactly. Thanks. We weren't even trying to follow you either, but oh, we came no. up behind you. Yeah, so. no, we were just 
Brody's Brody's samurai, the link's just extending out, so the rear end's all shifted just over. Tell my wife is like these samurais are just ridiculous. Hey, happy birthday, honey! <laughs> Seriously, oh, it's your birthday. Seriously, I know, right? Yeah, bro, I wasn't gonna give you. Yours. <laughs> what ended up happening under there? The upper link came loose. It just jammed up, came loose, and it walked over. Do you need us to push on the car? Or are you getting it? I think it's it's already there. I'm just making sure all the other jam nuts are tight. When uh, when we were sitting there, it looked like yeah, these lowers were loose. Awesome. Trucks. See, I told you not to cuss, oh, bro. Come on. Off road and stuff. <laughs> that was rad, Brody. Readjusted his link bars and got the rear end back underneath it where it needs to be. I met some dude that was super stoked to meet me, which was awesome. That's like unreal when that happens. It's his birthday too, so I sent him on ahead. Hopefully he can catch Fred and go say hi to him too. This is a really cool wash. This is one of those washes that's probably really fun in a side-by-side. -side. Not so fun in a samurai. <laughs> It's crazy how much open land there is in California to wheel on. This is like unheard of anywhere else in the country, right right here. Well, maybe Arizona. Dodge the rocks. Uh -oh. Oh. Hey, Brody's coming? Yeah, he's right behind me. I just couldn't see him. He didn't turn his lights on. Cruising. The rest of the group was already cruising a lot faster than us, so it's going to be kind of hard to catch back up unless they stop for a break, which they probably will. Oh, jeez. Smooth. <laughs> Crap. Pretty rad. Truck guys doing truck things. Kind of getting it. Mark's getting in the groove. Practically a rally car driver over here. Oh geez. This is all the beans. Something about the rear suspension on this yeah, thing.
all her camera work. I'm just like waving my arms like a lunatic. Good little boulder field up here. It looks like there's normal line over here. There's hard lines up through here. All kinds of good stuff. Marty's gone super high right. Get it, Martin. Just, no, you're all good. You just came down hard on that link bar. We're at 70, 75. Yeah, get it. Laura coming through in the super TJ. Unassumingly awesome Jeep. Oh, look at that thing go. Woohoo! Keep it. Now you're doing it. Brody's over here showing off. I can drive on big rocks too. Old man Fred. Hey, you got it. Hey, hold it. Hey, hold it. There you go. Good work. All right, Frank's coming up through here. Oh, Perfect. dang. Perfect Nailed it. Nailed it. Dang, Frank. Running out of the way. Nailed it. Was there a rock stand? Good work. So cool. Yeah. Right on, good work. Good work, Brody. What an awesome canyon. Look at this place. This is wild.
right? Drive up it. Oh, Keep God. going. He's gonna roll oh, it right oh. here. Is he? <laughs> Landed on Fred's hood. Yeah. Alright, I feel he's got it now. Not necessarily. You just, you're giving it the beans at the wrong time. Right there. What's that? When should I give it the beans? Right now. And stay in stay it. Stay in it. Don't stop. You keep letting off as soon as your back tires are right up against it. Right there? Yeah. Yeah. Those are the beans. There it is. Woo! That thing gets good traction. More bump. Yes. Woo! Clean. And this way. Yep. Nice work. Those things just work really good. Yes, they do. <laughs> Fred, can I get a little insight Eric from Filar. Eric Filar? World class rock crawler. Is that kind of diesel? Sandal wearer. <laughs> Gear installer. Oh, rock steering smasher. <laughs> steering box right into the rock. All right, Fred, what's he doing right here? He's turning left. <laughs> Should have went right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's all in the bumper. Oh, man. That's a bad idea. That isn't working at all, Eric. <laughs> Wasn't he the one that was just talking smack about how easy this should be? Man, that thing sounds good without a muffler on it. He's car yeah, he's carrying a rock with him back there. <laughs> This is my favorite maneuver, the get stuck and then peel out, yes. just for the sake of peeling out. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds good, Eric. I think oh. there's a trash can stuck <laughs> under your car. <laughs> that's your line right there. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Drive up the hill. Whoa. Drive up the hill. Yeah. Oh, he had it. <laughs> Sounds like when the when the big trucks load in the dumpster. Yeah. <laughs> that was perfect. Do it one more time. Stay on that one right here. No, What would you say that went for you? Oh, I feel like we accomplished a lot, actually. Very good work there. <laughs> I appreciate that. <laughs> We're all packing it up. That was a killer week, weekend. 
Brody's all loaded up. Mark's loaded up. Eric's loaded up. I think Fred's even loaded up. Time to get out of here. All right, we're back in the rental truck. That was an awesome weekend hanging with my buds in the desert. Happy birthday, Fred. That was a good time. I am gonna head up to Steve Dulcich's house to get some work done on a roadkill garage. So that's it for this dirt head shed. We'll see you guys next time.